When you receive your username and password for Microsoft 365 for Business, you need to take a few steps to get set up. Let's take a look. First, select the sign-in link in the email you received and enter the user ID and password that was provided to you. You may be required to take additional actions, such as changing your password or setting up additional security for your account. Next, install Microsoft 365 apps, such as Outlook, OneDrive, Word, and Teams, to your computer so you can use the full version of the apps, whether you're online or not. To start using email, open Outlook and add your new business email account. It takes just a few steps to get your email to start showing up in your new inbox. If you are already using Outlook, you'll now have multiple email accounts. You can either keep both inboxes separate or drag and drop one or more emails from your old inbox into your new one. Check out the link at the end of the video to learn more ways to import email, calendars, and contacts. Next, open up Teams to see what's happening at work through posts and chats with coworkers. And go to Files to add or open business documents that everyone can work on together. When it comes to your personal work files, move those files to OneDrive, where you control who can access them. Finally, add Outlook, OneDrive, and Teams to your phone and other mobile devices, so you can stay up to date with work, no matter where you are. Learn more about what you can do with Microsoft 365 for your business.